do you want to make money and do the habits that make the rich wealthy? Then this video is for you, as we look at 5 habits that the rich do that the poor don't. This is the second part of a 2 part series, so make sure to watch the first part to get the complete list. But for now, let's look at the 5 things that the rich do that the poor don't, and why this might be keeping you broke, or headed in that direction, that you could otherwise avoid. Number 1. They focus on people One of the most important habits that rich people have is they often make no to focus on personal relationships with people they know personally, colleagues or staff. The element of human interaction and treating people like people, rather than as a resource, is fundamental to building relations and rapport that prove beneficial in the long run. For example, it's been said that 80% of rich people make a habit to make a birthday call to people that they know, as opposed to just 11% of poor people. Given the importance of building relations as part of growing success, this goes a huge way to not just build a relationship, but make people feel unique and acknowledged as individuals, showing you actually care for them. Number 2. They don't gamble Many rich people don't place many hopes on gambling, or other forms of making money through luck or by chance, rather than focusing on building something that sustains wealth and gives stability. The fact is, they understand that forms of gambling are designed to make money, which is why the phrase the house always wins is used so commonly. This is quite different to many poor people. 52% of which have been found to play the lottery regularly in hope that they might someday strike it rich, significantly more than the 23% of the rich. What's interesting is that when you add up the years of playing the lottery, the amount of money spent would probably have been better utilised and invested in other things, as it won't be an insignificant sum. Number 3. They make daily positive choices there's a concept in Japan called Ikigai, and another throughout the world known as marginal gains, both of which emphasise the point that continuous small positive changes add up to big things. Many rich people apply similar ideas in their day to day lives, choosing to focus on small choices day to day that they know are to their benefit, health and well being. Over time, these add up in the long run, meaning the small, sometimes seemingly insignificant choices you make each day have a significant impact in your life. An obvious example is eating junk food daily, as when young it doesn't seem that bad and the effect on your body isn't obvious, but later in life it has a huge impact. Number 4. They watch less TV It's quite simple. The more time you spend doing leisurely activities such as watching TV and playing games, the less time you have to living like the 1% of society. Studies have shown that 60% of the rich watch an hour or less TV each day, from which only 6% watch reality TV, meaning a significant number of people don't really watch much TV. Contrast this with many poor people of which a shocking 78% of people watch reality TV, really emphasising how critical your use of time is. More than that, it also emphasises the importance of what you consume, as reality TV rarely serves any benefit past entertainment, meaning it has no notable productive value. Number 5. They read Simply put, many rich people will consume information and particularly spend time reading to help grow and educate themselves on a particular subject. Studies show that 88% of the wealthy read at least 30 minutes each day, a phenomenal difference to the poor, of which only 2% do the same. The key is that most of them read to educate themselves, and also imprint this onto their children, as 63% make their children read 2 or more non-fiction books a month compared to the 3% of poor people. All of this goes to show, a part of why the rich are rich is that they have habits to support their endeavours to earn more, they care more for themselves and continuously seek growth. So do the same, take on positive habits and enjoy the wealth that comes with it. Do you do as the rich do or the poor? Let me know in the comment section below. Please like, share and subscribe, as we help you live life on your terms. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to ensure YouTube notifies you of the latest uploads. Thanks for watching.